Hey guys, it's Shaylee, and we're just not gonna talk about what I look like right now. It's about 10 o'clock at night. I'm trying to do schoolwork, but I wanted to film this for you real quick, so we're just in comfy clothes with my hair in a bun. I'm also leaning in a little bit because I have my space heater on, and I'm hoping that it's not too loud for you guys. <clears throat> so, for my two weeks one palette, last for the past two weeks I've been using the Kat Von D metal matte palette and I love this palette so much guys um, this is what it looks like I don't know if you can tell but I use this pink shade oh, let's see if I can pull this better I use this pink shade um, uh, maybe like four times I use this purple shade a couple times this brown shade, bronzy shade a couple times, and I used this pretty teal color a little bit, which I actually loved. And I dabbled into some of these, like the purples and the pinks I used with these colors. Um, I used the stone color when I used this color. Um, but yeah, so I really, really love this palette, and I loved using it for the past two weeks. But I had you guys vote again on if I should use my singles or my love rock unzipped is that what it was i don't really remember what the other one was but basically you guys voted on my singles and i put all of them in here just so i have them all together with the rest of my makeup um to make easy decisions on what i want to use um and basically i'm just gonna be using these for the next two weeks i plan on using my ColourPop ones the matte ones too just because they add a little bit more dimension and gives me a little bit um, better outlook with my purple looks. Um, but I'll just run through them real quick. I have ColourPop's Acorn. I have ColourPop's Tang. Should I uncover them? Okay. So this is Acorn. And this is Tang. And then I have Central Perk. Then my last, oh, dropping things. My last ColourPop shadow is called Millionaire. That's what it looks like. And then for the rest of them, I have one Essence eyeshadow in the Grammy Goes Glammy. I have a NYX single in Bedroom Eyes. It's one of the prismatic ones. Super excited to use this because I love this eyeshadow. I don't use it often enough. Obviously. Uh, a Wet n Wild single in Nutty. This little Makeup Forever uh, sample I got in a Sephora Play Box. That's I-544 which is like a pretty purple, like a muted purple shade. Like a taupey purple. That sounds good. And then I have this, oh, I'm going to go to this, Manicatar Beauty. And this is in the shade Fantasy. This packaging is so hard for me to open and I don't understand why. Um, but it's just like this really pretty, like, mauve pink shade that I'm super excited to use. And I got this in a birch box, actually. So I'll be using these... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. These nine singles for the next two weeks, and I'll let you guys know how I like them. Um, I don't think I have a palette that I want to decide yet, but if I do, I'll put it in a poll or something. But yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.